everybody, Susie Q here and welcome to Q Aquatics and Exotics. And today I want to show you what I did with my electric blue Jack Dempsey that was covered in ink. Before I start, I feel like I should make a disclaimer. Most of you who know me know I am not an expert. I am brand new to this. I research YouTube. I follow some key fish tubers that I really like how their fish room looks. And I usually follow their advice or I listen to everybody's advice, make my own decisions based on the supplies that I have and the fish that I have, which is what I did in this case. And I think some fish might travel better than others. And I know getting him in the bag, he was pretty stressed out. The ride home was pretty long. And then the acclimation process was pretty long. Maybe I should have done a plop and drop. I don't know. For whatever reason, his defense mechanism, his slime coat was down. He got ick. So I had to build back up that slime coat, make sure he was eating. <laughs> and treat for the ick. So I hope you'll come along with and I will show you what process I went through. And it was about five, six days, four days of treatment. Yeah, so an overview, two days of API, four days of ickx, and three days of observations before he came back into this tank. So let's go check out what I did. So if you saw my last video putting together this 40 gallon planted tank, You'll notice at the end, I added my electric blue Jack Dempsey. I felt pretty safe adding him because he's the only fish in the tank. No problem, right? Well, look what I saw. I was watching the GoPro footage and there it was. Ick. I didn't see it with my eyes. I saw it with the GoPro footage about an hour later. So I immediately removed him and put him in a smaller tank, this 10 gallon. So I cranked up the heat, added the API Super Ick Cure and aquarium salt to this 10 gallon tank. Okay, so the Super Ick Cure is going to increase the slime coat protection. It's also going to start on the Ick. I added them to the 10 gallon tank because it's a smaller quantity of medication that I would need. Increasing the temperature is going to expedite the life cycle of the Ick. And in give me buy me time to go to the store and get some ickx so it actually took me a couple days to not only find the ickx in in stores but to get it so i came home did a water change gravel vac and get ready to start my new medication ickx if you could have a favorite for ick medicine i would be ickx so today is day one with ickx so um, let's go in the tank and see if he's too shy to cease. So the only opportunity I have to remove those disgusting parasites is to gravel vac them off the floor after they've fallen off him. I can't remove them from his body, or that's why the heat speeds up the life cycle so they, they fall off him faster. I'm going to be doing a water change every day with new medication. We are going to check out day four of my electric blue jap dimsy. Hoping this medicine works because I really love this fish. Oh, he is starting to look a little better. I'm telling you this, it's a got to stay on top of this. I don't want to miss any treatments. I don't want to miss any gravel vac because he is starting to look so much better. And he's eating like a champ, which is a very good sign. I just noticed that he can see through the tank to the next tank over to the angelfish. So he kind of flares up at them. I'm like, he's got some spunk. Okay, here we go again. Next day. Oh, this is so much fun. Hey, let's see how my guy looks at day five. Oh my gosh. I'm so glad he looks so much better. Because I only can do one more treatment. It says you can only do four treatments. And it's amazing. I'm going to do one more treatment and he looks like he's got rid of Ick and I can put him back in his home. Now the 40 gallon breeder has been on high heat and I must have done about the same amount of water changes, one every day uh, with gravel vac to make sure that there were no parasites left. But 
from what I hear, there's always parasites in your tank. There's always ick in your tank. It's just whether or not fish are healthy enough and in a good enough slime coat that they don't attach. I don't know how true that is, but that's what I'm going with. God, I am so happy that my electric blue Jack Dempsey is feeling much better. So, so happy. And now he's back in his home and he's not alone. So I really would love to hear from you how you treat ick or have you ever got ick? Thanks for checking out the process I went through for ick. And I am just so happy it turned out this way. So I will see you next time.